what's up scorpios this is your reading for april the 5th to april the 9th um this reading will not resonate with everyone slash no one take what resonates with your soul and leave the rest behind okay all right i'm gonna pull a couple of messages for you guys okay divine holy spirit archangels ancestors and spirit guides show me what i need to see for my scorpios for april the 5th to april the 9th show me what i need to see divine holy spirit and thank you for the messages we will receive oh oh yeah i popped out three so we got fear. I realize that I am testing my my resolve to life in energy of love. Oh, let me say that again. Fear. I realize that I am testing my resolve to live in the energy of love. And then we got abundance. I am a limitless being and I can manifest whatever I desire in the physical reality. And we also got patience. I accept that everything happens in divine order. <clears throat> so, okay. With these cards here, I, you guys, <laughs> you have lived in fear, not realizing that you was living in fear. I know that's crazy, right? You have to come to a point in your life where you take a leap of faith. You go outside of your comfort zone. Many of you have put up walls to protect yourself. If one thing I don't know about a Scorpio, we, we like to feel like we're protected. We like to have their security. And it is hard for a lot of us to step outside of your our comfort zone. But you have to choose to either step outside of your comfort zone or have a limit a limit in your life because you cannot progress in this world without doing things you've never done before many of you are starting to overcome this fear this is this fear is in the past here this uh, this is past energy that you're coming out of Many of you are stepping outside of your comfort zone right now, and it's about to lead to your abundance. There's things that is stored inside of you that only you know, okay? You're finna get ready to reach deep down inside of you and find out who you really are. Why are you really here? Your true talents, your your inner you, your real you. For so long, you've been you've been trying to be what the world has wanted you to be. But you're changing your direction now. You're starting to do what makes you happy. What makes you happy? What makes your soul sing? Many of you. Many of you, you feel you felt like your job was like a security blanket. A lot of you guys stayed at jobs that you absolutely do not want to be at and haven't wanted to be at in a long time. A lot of you guys are even leaving jobs that that do not serve your highest good anymore. It's time for you to go. And by you doing this, I feel like you're about to take a leap of faith because you're going into your abundance. But what you having to do now is to be patient as well. I feel like this is something you, ha you had to work on because for a lot of us, we like stuff right now. <laughs> not later right now <laughs> and you're learning to have patience though you, you you're i feel like a lot of you you had to go and do a lot of inner 
anal analyzing, like analyzing yourself, looking at yourself from within, seeing what needed to be, be fixed, what needed to go, what you didn't need to hold on to anymore. You realize it was weighing you down. Many, many of us, we had to take a test recently and it was either pass or fail. And I feel like a lot of us passed that test. Now it's time for the abundance. You know, I feel like this is coming. I really do feel like this is coming. It's going to come when you surrender. When, when you completely let go of fear, period, it's coming. It's coming. All right, y'all, we're going to go ahead and jump into tarot. I'm going to make these this uh, video a little short. I got to get to work and I got a couple of more I need to do. Divine Holy Spirit, show me what I need to see for my Scorpios for April the 5th to April the 9th. What do my Scorpios need to know, Divine Holy Spirit? For April the 5th to April the 9th. Ooh. okay so we got chopped wood yeah many of y'all with this broom and this mop and the door is open many of you you're tired of living the same life look the bottom of the dead happy happy you ready to be happy okay but i do feel like a lot of you are starting to put in the work you're putting in the the work now, and this is gonna bring you happiness. You finna let your 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 light shine. You're gonna be receiving information on what you need to to do, and you're gonna be birthed in something, birthed in something new, and you're gonna be happy. Okay, happy baby. That's what I'm talking about. Yes. See, we're gonna jump into tarot real quick and pull a couple of cards in. I'm gonna let y'all go. <clears throat> Divine Holy Spirit, show me what I need to see for my Scorpios for April the 5th to April the 9th. What do my Scorpios need to see? Divine Holy Spirit. Show me what I need to see for Ooh. Oh, oh, baby. Ace of Cups. Yeah, Spirit is fixing to gift you with something amazing. Wonderful, loving. Oh, you're going to be happy. And it's going to show on the outside. People going to, when they see you, you gonna, your aura going to be on point, okay? on point. They don't need some blockers to look at you. <laughs> look. We got the four ones here in the reverse, you guys. I feel like y'all, I feel like a twin flame. I, feel, <laughs> I know y'all don't want me to say this. Y'all don't want me to say this. But some of you guys, it's a twin flame that's going to try to reach out to you and you don't block their ass. But I feel like this person try to get around. Like, even if you block them, they find some other method to reach out to you, to talk to you. This person could possibly email you. But I feel like some of you got y'all is not even going to answer this. You're not even going to respond. It's a wrap. It's over with. Like, that's what I feel off this card right here. Y'all finna shake somebody's world up. But real talk, I feel like... <laughs> <laughs> Y'all gonna be happy <laughs> for the week of uh the fifth to the ninth. Y'all finna be happy. Y'all not worried about this no more. You're letting go. You're letting go. You're surrendering. Okay, we got strength in this uh in the reverse here. This person, yeah, I feel like this person don't have the strength to come to you. Like they they're scared to even talk to you face to face. That's why this person try to reach out to you like 
by messages and stuff like that. They they want to see how you feel. They want to see where your energy is at because they really not for sure if they talk to you right now, they should wait for a minute, you know. This person, <clears throat> yeah, I just I just heard coward. I heard um, coward, and I saw the uh, the the lying off of the um, shit. <laughs> oh, sorry, hold on, y'all. Off of uh, the Wizard of Oz, yeah, the coward, cowardly lion. Yeah, this person <laughs> is they gonna try to come in and speak to you? I feel. Divine Holy Spirit, show me what I need. Y'all, the whole deck want to come out. I did see the Six of Cups in the reverse here. So, yeah, this person is obsessively thinking about you. Divine Holy Spirit. Oh, y'all, too many cards. It's too many, Spirit. <laughs> One at a time, Spirit. Divine Holy Spirit, show me what I need to see. Yeah. Yeah, this person got a lot on their back here. They got a lot on their back. They got the whole world on, on their back, and they feel like you're the only one that can help them fix it. Mm-hmm. Somebody realized that the grass wasn't greener on the other side. They had put a wall up. A, they, they, they built a wall to block themselves from reaching out to you, from talking to you. This person did everything they could possibly do to like forget about you. But they see like the grass ain't greener on the other side. They this person is really ashamed right now. They shameful. King of Cups. Yeah, this person <laughs> let me see. I'm gonna clarify this this King of Cups. The, to look at the bottom, at the bottom of the deck, it was the emperor. But I'm gonna clarify the king of cups, divine holy spirit. Show me what I need to see. Why is the king of cups here for the Scorpios? For ever the fifth to the ninth. Why is the king of cups here? <laughs> so justice in reverse. Yeah, this person would. This person. I feel like they're in trouble with the law, for one. They're in trouble with the law. And this person could be um, a, a Pisces, a Scorpio, or a Cancer, by the way. Or they could be a, Le a Leo. I mean, not Leo. Yeah, a Leo and a Libra. But, yeah, this person, this person is not balanced. They in and out of trouble with the law. This person is in trouble with the law. They trying to go around the law right now. I feel like they facing some type of judgment too. Something is going on with this person. And I feel like they think that you're the only one that can help them. That's all I can hear. They think you're the only one that can help them. You could have helped this person out a lot in the past. And look. Yeah, this person is trying to escape the law or something. Something that they did wrong. They they trying to to escape something. They they trying to get out of something. I feel I'm sorry I keep saying it, y'all, but I just feel that. I feel that off of this car these cars here. I feel like this person did you real foul in the past. They done did a lot of people foul and it's starting to catch up with their ass. Divine Holy Spirit, show me what I need to see. Yeah. They indecisive. They indecisive. They going back and forth in their mind. This person's emotions is a wreck, by the way. Their emotions is all over the place. They don't know what to do. They all up in their head. Any more messages, Spirit, for my Scorpios? Anything else my Scorpios need to know, Spirit? So many Spirit. Spirit want to give me the whole day. They want, Spirit want me to tell you everything that person is doing right now. What they done did. Look, stalking you. 
they stalking you, they watching you, they checking out your social media. You know, you post something as soon as you post it, especially if you post it in that little um, add to your story on Facebook, you scroll all the way at the bottom, you will see where it says one person has viewed your story that you are not friends with. That's this person here. Yeah. Yeah. We got the two of cups here in the reverse. Yeah, this was a soulmate here. But this person is non-committal. This person is non-committal and they don't follow through on what they say they're supposed to do. This person don't follow through on things. Any more messages, spirit, for my Scorpios? Any more messages, spirit, for my Scorpios? For April the 5th to the 9th. Y'all, I would you I spirit want to throw me in the hole yet. Mm. Divine Holy Spirit, give me one more card for my Scorpios. <laughs> Y'all, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take the one that flipped over, okay? Because spirit wanna tell want me to tell it like it is. Okay. <laughs> we got the death card. You show we showed up in our own reading, okay? Death card, Scorpio. You're you're spiritually developing developing right now. You don't have time for the BS. You know all about this person. And once you learn the truth about a person, once you learn a person true colors, you let it go. You don't hold on to stuff like this. And when a Scorpio lets something go, they let something go. They don't go that back and forth type of stuff. They let it go. You're, tra you're you're going through a transition. You're transforming right now. You don't have time for, for games. And you don't have time for this person. This person done shows you what they all about. They done shows you what they all about here. And look, on the deck, six of cups in reverse. This person is obsessively thinking about you. They wish they had you back. They wish you now. They are wishing. Spirit, any more messages for my Scorpios? <laughs> we got the Hierophant here. You protected. You are protected. This is spirit. <laughs> this person can't touch you. <laughs> it is what it is. Keep it moving. Keep it pushing. I feel like the Scorpios are, are focusing on themselves, on their life. If you got kids, you're focusing on um, your family. You just don't, you don't have time for it anymore. You don't. The so God Holy Spirit, what's the advice for the Scorpios? For April the 5th to April the 9th, what is the advice for the Scorpios? For April the 5th to April the 9th, show me what I need to see, Divine Holy Spirit. What's the advice for the Scorpios? <laughs> no. Spirit said, no. This person can wish all they want. They can wish upon the star, whatever spirit is telling them. No, I feel like a lot of for a lot of you, like your person might be in spiritual jail too. By the way, but you're you're not taking this person back. <laughs> yeah, the bottom of the deck it says opportunity. I feel like this person look at you as an opportunity to fix their problems the devil is a lie so anyway all right you guys that is the <laughs> that is the message <laughs> all right anyway uh all right you guys i want to wish you peace love and light if you like this content please like share and subscribe i love you guys so i'll see you later bye